I, I need you to get this. I need, we need to get this, especially into the heads of our younger people who are impressionable by social media. Christianity is about history. Real history recorded by historians. Christianity is not a philosophy. It's not a philosophy. There are certain religious systems like Buddhism, that's a philosophy. That's an ism. That is, that, you know, the thing about like Buddhism and Hinduism and Confucianism and all the isms, you know, their, their truth, their truth goes marching on, but they don't go marching on. Our Jesus, who is the truth, dies, comes back, his truth goes marching on, and he goes marching on. That is a huge difference. And, and so Luke died serving Jesus blamelessly as a historian. So the center of Christianity is not a philosophy. The center of Christianity is not a place. You know, Muslims turn to Mecca. They turn and they literally bow to Mecca. We don't bow to Jerusalem. We don't bow the knee and pray to Jerusalem. We don't do that. Christianity is a person. It is a person, and it is his accomplished work, praise the Lord. It is all about Jesus. Christianity is about Jesus. I'm sure some of y'all had a great experience over there in Israel, and I would love to go and see those holy places. And you do feel close to Jesus when you're over there, right, folks? You feel it's so cool to see those places, but he's not there. The Bible says he is seated at the right hand of the Father on high right now, interceding for his people. And his Holy Spirit lives within his people, and wherever they go, he goes with them. Maybe one day I'll, we can go over there and do a tour together when things settle down. That'd be cool, wouldn't it? Go to Israel and see it and praise the Lord together over there. So I want to talk about the implications of that, right? Uh, you know, we don't adhere to a philosophical uh, system. We don't necessarily travel to a sacred place instead we get to know a living breathing person the god man jesus christ that would be pretty bad if it was all about a place because most people will never get there that would be pretty bad if it was about a philosophical system or ism or or a certain doctrinal system instead of the person and work of jesus christ because you're going to fail those systems if Jesus is dead, then Christianity is dead with it. Paul says, if Jesus is not risen from the de dead, well, what's the point? What's the point coming in here, listening to the foolishness of preaching? What is the point? There's no point where, because life has problems, and you're going to continue to have problems. If Jesus is still dead, there's no point in even showing up. But if Jesus is alive, that explains why Christianity is still alive and probably the most dominant religion on the planet. It may not feel like it here, but the gospel is spreading all over the world. A mustard seed that's expanding into the future with all peoples everywhere all around the globe. And we want to be a part of that here at City on the Hill Church. It is all about Jesus.